changing lives and making a difference. And, you know, that's what we do. So what are you going to talk about? I'm going to talk about how do you create more success in today's economy? What does it take to truly build a very, very successful company from scratch? Or maybe if you're in, if maybe you're in transition. How do you find that new place to go? Take your passion, your dream, and turn them into a business that makes money. Can you give us one little snippet of what you're talking about? One little snippet would be, um, big thing here, find your passion, right? Literally live your passion. Life is way too short to live someone else's plan. Absolutely. It's a great time to live your plan and go out there and have the right ideas, the right concepts, and the team to execute that vision, that passion into success. That's great. And what would you say to an audience right now of entrepreneurs who's really struggling to make it in this economy? Uh, stay the course. Absolutely stay the course. You know, stay with your belief systems. Stay on, uh, on path and purpose. That's the big thing. But more importantly, I think it goes along once you've got that, surround yourself with a great team. You know, you got to have a great team, but listen, be persistent. So many companies fail because they quit right on the edge of success. You've got a great team here. Uh, everyone that I talk to <laughs> says, oh, you're part of Bill Walsh's team. Half the audience is Bill Walsh's you know, team. We travel with a good entourage, and, and I think it really goes back to the fact that in the cities that we travel to, U.S., Canada, Europe, now the Caribbean, when you start changing people's lives, more people show up for your cause. And it really is about... To make a big change in the world and really empower business owners and have them dream and dream big, uh, it's not easy, but you're, it's possible. You're really shifting the paradigm in the way this economy is. Well, you know, it really does start with Small Business America. Innovation, I mean, think about this. Eight years ago, this guy had an idea about selling shoes online, right? He says, I think I can do a better job of selling shoes online. Worst economy, challenging times. Company did a billion dollars last year called Zappos. Another guy had an idea to launch a business online because he couldn't get a date. So he launched a social media site. His, his name was Mark Zuckerberg. You probably heard of the company called Face. That's right, Facebook. He now has 500 million friends. So innovation and technology and belief can create the biggest success stories of our time. More millionaires in the next 10 years than the last 100 combined. You heard it here first. Thank you, Bill. Thank you so much for having me. Awesome. Good to see you soon. Thanks again.